The air quality has descended uh, to the very poor category in Delhi over the past few weeks. Uh, when we are moving from the middle of September towards October, we are noticing that uh, the air is becoming smoggier. And what is happening is, uh, this year in 2018, in September, we saw a couple of good days and most of September was in the satisfactory category. But now suddenly in the middle of uh, October, the air quality has descended into the very poor category and the level of PM2.5 has crossed 300 micrograms per cubic meter, whereas the standard is 100. The onset of winter causes uh, the inversion effect, which means that the existing pollution load does not escape easily from the, uh, the air shed of Delhi NCR. The second reason is Temporary uh, seasonal sources add to the pollution load and these pollution loads uh, stay in the air, uh, eventually increasing to levels where we can visibly see the air pollution. The chief amongst this is the uh, crop residue burning that happens around this time of the year in the states of Punjab and Haryana. Crop residue is being burned because, mainly because the transition time between the Kharif and the Rabi crops is decreasing. More and more farmers are trying to have multiple crops uh, in their fields in a year and because of this they have very little time to prepare their fields for the next crop. So around this time of the year paddy is harvested and after harvesting the stubble that gets left behind on the, uh, on the field that uh, needs to be removed by either agricultural implements or via manual labor. Now the access to the agricultural implements is very poor at the moment. Uh, not many farmers have access to this and therefore the easiest and the most economical way is to simply set it to fire and burn it. Now why is this bad? Because uh, burning of this agricultural stubble directly contributes to uh, PM10 emissions. PM10 are the larger of the particulate matter emissions and these are very harmful because they penetrate deep inside your body, uh, they go inside your lungs and they cause long term medical effects uh, to your pulmonary systems. What happens is around uh, this time of the year, between mid-September to mid-November, the direction of wind is mostly in the south to southwest direction, which means that the air uh, from over Punjab uh, travels over Haryana and comes down to the Delhi and NCR region. This, cause, this means that the emissions that are occurring there in the fields by, caused by the burning of pad, paddy stubble, those get directly added to the uh, existing pollution load over Delhi and NCR. So, uh, if you look at the pattern of the wind, it comes from the uh, north towards the uh, south, south and southwest direction, coming directly over the uh, cities of Patiala, uh, Karnal and coming down over the Delhi NCR region. What is the solution for this going forward? For specifically for the problem of crop residue burning, uh, it, it needs to be ensured that Farmers have wider and more real access to agricultural implements which can help them uh, remove this crop stubble and uh, to monetize this crop stubble in very real ways. Although current ex currently existing government policies do address this in some way, there is a lot more work that needs to be done. In the long term, crop diversification is also another issue that needs to be addressed uh, where uh, the, the cultivation of paddy needs to be disincentivized in this region because of the air pollution problems that it is causing. If we don't address this problem urgently, we will uh, come back to the scenario that we saw in 2016 and in 2017. We will have very high, uh, severe and severe plus pollution days where the smog is so bad that visibility becomes very poor and this will directly uh, affect our health not just in the immediate term but also in the long term.